Hi there. Now for this question, we're asked to express then 2 sine theta minus 4 cos theta in the form r sine theta minus alpha. And we've got to calculate alpha to three decimal places. Now to do this, you should be familiar with these particular identities. If not, do check them out on my website, the tutorials. And you'll notice that the one that we've got here, 2 sine theta minus 4 cos theta, corresponds to this second one here. And r is always the square root of a squared plus b squared, and alpha is the inverse tan of b over a. So for this one here, all we've got then is we take the expression that we're given, 2 sine theta minus 4 cos theta, and I can see that this is identical then in form to a sine theta minus b cos theta. Where clearly a is the 2 and b is the 4. Okay, so b equals the 4. It's not minus 4 because we've already got that minus corresponding with that minus there. So b is 4. And that means that therefore alpha is equal to the inverse tan of b being 4 over a, which is 2. So in other words, alpha equals the inverse tan of 2. And if you work that out, make sure that you're in radians mode on your calculator, you should find that alpha turns out to be equal to 1.1071 and so on radians. And we've got to give it to three decimal places, so therefore alpha equals 1.107 to three decimal places, 3dp for short.